Welcome everyone, my name is Nicole and today we have a nice gentle 20 minute or so flow. So when you are ready, we are going to begin laying down on our backs in Shavasana. And go ahead and just cactus the arms here. And then you have about the feet about as wide as the mat. And just take a few deep breaths in through the nose and out. Breathing deeply in, filling up the belly. And exhaling it all out. One more deep breath in. And sigh it out. And from here, just gently let the knees start to tick tock one way and then the other. Exhaling down and inhaling up. And close the eyes down. And then let the knees come back to center at the top. Cross your right ankle just above your left knee, making a figure four. And breathing. And then what? your knee, fall to the left, and then inhale back to center, and then go the other way, and inhale back up, and exhale, real gentle, real slow, And then we're going to switch, readjust if you need to, and then do the other side, left ankle cross just above the right knee, take some breaths here, foot flexed. And then begin to twist off both ways, slow and gentle. And then come undone, hug the knees in, roll around on the low back if that feels nice. Hands out at a T or in cactus. And then bring your knees, feet up, and then Exhale, twist off the right. Inhale, center. 
And exhale the other way. Keeping the core engaged. Last few rounds. And then back to center. Soles of the feet touch, press together. And then bring your hands down under your knees. Help them back up. And then we're going to roll to our right side. Use your hands. Push yourself back to a seated position. And then come to a comfortable seat. And you may want to sit up on something, block, bolster. Sway side to side. Think about growing a little bit in each sway. And then pause in center. And let your ear drop your right shoulder. And now your head back. And then let the ear fall to your other shoulder. And breathe here. up overhead and then fold forward you can drop the head tent the fingers and push your hips back into the earth And then walk your fingers off to the right. A little side stretch here. And then back through center and off the other way. And then inhale, through center, and inhale, come back up to a seated position. We're going to switch the cross on our legs now. And hands on our knees, we're going to do a little seated cat-cow. So. Suck in through the core, round through the back of the heart, drop the head, and then inhale, come through, broaden across.
across the chest. Lift the chin. Tailbone to the sky back there. <laughs> and then move rock between the two. Breathing. And then if you want to add a little circular motion now, go ahead and do some spinal circles that don't have to look any particular way. It can be small, or you can really get into it. It doesn't really matter. Just if you can enjoy the movement and or the sensation, at least Notice it. Notice what's happening. And go the other way if you have not changed directions. And then when you're ready, find center, take a breath in, and we're going to bring our fingertips to our shoulders, rolling our shoulders down onto our back, chin neutral, core engaged, begin to twist side to side, including the head. We're going to move this way for a few moments, so get comfy and move at whatever pace calls to you. So you can be really slow or really fast. <laughs> And then slowly come back to center. Release the hands. Take a breath in. Notice how we just stirred up some energy there. And then we're going to come around to all fours. Knees are under hips, and you can have your feet flat or toes curled under, and then our hands are going to extend out along the earth, and our chest drops down, and we either then rest our head down, or as we continue to open up, the chest comes down, chin comes forward, Puppy pose. Breathe. And then I know. Shift forward all the way onto your belly. <laughs> Forearms press down, elbows under your shoulders. Lift your chest. Maybe do a little figure eights with the nose.
and then when you're ready here, we're gonna flow back and forth between child's pose and baby cobra. So hands under the shoulders, roll your shoulders back, inhale, and begin to lift up and press back. Knees wide. Drop the head, exhale. And then inhale, begin to shift forward. Come down, exhale. Roll the shoulders, inhale. And exhale, press back. Coming forward. Exhaling down. Inhaling, roll the shoulders. Exhale, press back. Toes touch, child's pose. And stay here. And breathe. And using your hands, press yourself back to a seated position. And drop your hips to the left and bring your feet around front. And feet flex, knees bent, a whole bunch. And just take a moment to get real nice and tall on the spine here. particularly in this low back. And then maybe grab for your feet and keep the knees bent a whole bunch. And find a nice place where we're not necessarily focusing on the legs, but we're focusing on the spine. So come forward as much until you feel like you're starting to lose it till you start to sink. And maybe that's... Experiment. Let's see what you think. You know, and then only continue to straighten the legs as long as you can maintain this contact and feel like your low back is long. We have all that, then go ahead and Round the upper back, drop the head, and breathe. And here, you can imagine the base of your spine sending breath all the way up to the tip of your head, and then exhale all the way back down. And just spend some time breathing this way, up and down. And then core engage, come back up. And we're going to prepare to lay back down onto our backs once more. Knees bent. And go ahead and cross your right foot above your left knee again. And this time, lift your foot off of the earth Reach your hand through the hole, and then come around with the opposing hand. Or just clasp around the legs. Either way, keep your feet flexed, and keep breathing. Head back, all relaxing on the earth.
And then release, switch. And lift the bottom foot off. Reach your left hand through the hole and around and, and clasp hands or, or just reach around wherever. Done. Grab for the outside edges of your feet. Happy baby. Roll around if that calls to you. Hug yourself into a ball, squeeze your muscles tight, hold your breath. When you can't hold it any longer, come undone. Lay out on the earth, feet roll out, palms turn up. Take a moment and get comfy. Shoulders lightly roll under. Or you can take any variation that calls to you that will bring you more ease. <laughs> Wherever you're at, just relax. Integrate your practice. We'll guide you on just a few moments. If you'd like to come out, bring small movement back to your body. Roll to your right side, take a deep breath in. And then using your hand, go ahead and push yourself back to a seated position. Thank you so much for practicing with me. The light within me sees and recognizes the light within you. Take care.